This is an update to the snowfall forecast. I did lower the numbers a little bit for most places. As you head farther north, we're going to have a tough time getting much accumulating snow. So we lowered that to a trace to two inches. Everywhere in the blue, likely two to four inches of snow. However, south of Milwaukee, especially close to the lakeshore here, Racine, uh, Kenosha counties, this is where we're expecting to see the heaviest snow still four to eight, maybe even a few select places see more than eight inches, and that's due to lake effect snow. Here's how it looks with future forecasts as we move through this evening. You see these lake effect bands setting up. Those are really critical to the snowfall forecast. And that's why we think uh, lakeshore areas of Racine and Kenosha County will see the highest snowfall totals. 10 o'clock tonight, we're still going to be tracking snow. We've still got those lake effect snow bands going. The snow ends from west to east overnight, but look at 2 a.m. in the morning. We still have the lake effect snow ongoing. That's going to boost those totals in that area. By 5 a.m., the snow is out of here. Here's your seven day tomorrow. The cold air sets in 19, but it will feel like single digits Four overnight. Uh, it'll feel like below zero 25 on Monday with some sunshine. Tuesday, we're back to 35 uh, Wednesday. We've got uh, the chance for snow in the forecast, plus some gusty winds and then another cool down. We're in the teens Thursday and Friday overnight lows in the single digits.